it's not just me at places like this. Really? You know, it's not just me. There's legends roaming what around. What the fuck is going on? <laughs> oh! Oh! How the fuck is you just sitting out here? Yeah, come on. Come on. Thank you for the green tea. <laughs> Coach JB. Yeah! JB's house. Hey, JB's house looks great behind you. Um, so I was supposed to go to JB's house and we were going to kind of do a pop in and let JB do his picks. And I was going get, to get to meet Stogie and all the other slapdick dogs he's got running around his house. And I was going to see the whole thing. I was very excited for that. Instead, what I realized immediately upon planning to drive to his house, it's like a two hour fucking drive. Oh. So I, I said, Hey, JB can't do it. I need you to meet me. He recommended this place. I'm going to chance to meet him in real. Hey, what's up? Dude, what's by the way? This is my first time uh, meeting him in real life. <laughs> and also, we got to get the JB picks in, don't we? Yeah. That's something yeah. we have to have. And Diggs, Diggs I got to correct you. Ontario is not the valley or near the point of the world. <laughs> there is actually a valley in Cali, and that's called Simi Valley in Woodland Hills, which is about a two hours north of us. That's the porn capital of the world. You idiot. <laughs> well, I knew the valley was. I didn't know that your valley was a different fucking valley. Nah, he's just in a valley. He ain't in the valley. This ain't the valley. We're in fucking Ontario. This is like uh, the IE, man. This is out here kind of, you know, there's a fucking semi-pro team playing where he's hosting the wrestling event. This ain't a major, you know, oh, my, I, I mean, right, we don't need to bury this yeah, place. Yeah, the, on, the like, Ontario like raid. He has had to stick up for the left coast a little bit these last couple of weeks. It feels like a lot of people, and I, I can sense this from JB's head shake, and when he was doing that, he was moving the cigar that's as thick as a telephone pole, and the smoke was going into this young lady's face over here. It was fantastic, that whole situation there. But I don't think anybody really thinks he could potentially be a guy, and maybe physically he could. I don't know if he's shown that I haven't watched mm -hmm. enough, but mentally being an NFL quarterback is a fucking lot. Yeah. Like, that he's physically tough. gifted. He's he super physically gifted. And then transfer, I don't know how – mentally tough uh you know these gms are really going to want to go after you i don't i don't know how that sits with him uh i don't know i don't think he's that talented to be honest with you i think he's a little overrated well well you said that about carson wentz two he threw for 400 yards oh. yeah and they lost yeah but three, <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> fucking, uh what's his name burrow every game last year blew out his knee all right all right wentz is, oh man you guys love wentz Sorry about it. Hey, how's it going? I mean, this is absurd. We are in the middle of like a shop. Pat's getting red. Pat's getting sunburned out here. You know, I always, he's got hair. I don't, so I'll have a. Hey, you should see this. JB showed up, by the way. He's got this massive watch on. Okay, he's got these clean case Swisses. Hey. You don't know about the And then he's got this national championship uh, ring on AJ. Look at it. Married to the game. Wow. Married to the game. Hey. I won't say what I want to say, but yeah, you know, married <laughs> to the game here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Ty, I know you had a question for Coach JB, and I was hoping we'd be able to answer from his house with Stogie around. A bird just sit on me. <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, little baby? <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, it's good, it's good luck. It's good luck. It's good luck. Good luck. Pinks are a lock this weekend. Those Ontario birds. <laughs> He's to wipe off with a leaf. <laughs> <laughs> Coach Shitbird. Yeah. Yep. Coach Shitbird. Man. Coach Coach like shitbird. <laughs> <laughs> Can't make this shit up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this dude walks up, by the way. Uh -huh. So I'm in the middle of chatting with you guys. I look over. I'm talking Stogie just hanging out. He's got the Billy strut almost going. This son of a bitch commands a little bit of attention when he walks into a room around here. Hell hey, yeah. Hey, did you get anything uh, delivered to your uh, room this week or no? I had the shit set up for him, man. I, he, he, you know, I'm going to scoop him up from the airport and shit. I, I, he was like, hey, I got a rental car. I was like, look, I didn't mean to be your fucking, uh, you know, I'm going to take you around town every uh, all day, every day. I said, I'll pick you up from the airport, take you to your fucking rental car. We can go get a steak or something. Yeah, you know? he was trying to. And I had edibles for him. He uh, did. He did. He told me I, I got some real ones, and I didn't know what that meant. You know, cause... Yeah, they're real. <laughs> you know, 10 milligram, 30 milligram. I don't, I don't eat them, so I don't know nothing about them. But obviously, growing up how I grew up, I got people, that, you know, that knows the guy. I know, I know a guy, and that guy has uh, the real deals, man. And uh, I think Pat, I don't know if Pat would have been up right now. No, oh, we we'll get it. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Listen, I, I, I heard, right. I heard, I heard. You like Snoop Dogg? Yeah. Hey, I ain't worried about no Compton, nothing. I want to let you know that. Okay. No doubt. No doubt. AJ, AJ. <laughs> What's up? 
could you imagine if we would have came back and me and JB are sitting in his studio over there, like oh. kicked up different directions. So that the was supposed to be out. what it was supposed to be. That was what it was supposed to be. And here we are in the middle of like the wow. nicest place I've ever seen. And he's losing his mind getting shitted on. This was supposed <laughs> to go a little differently. Well, when did you, uh, when did you check that? When did you find out it was a two hour drive from your hotel to where JB was? I would imagine that's something you, you probably could have checked maybe two or three days ago. I would, Hey, let him clarify. You know how the city goes. It was 40 something minutes, but it felt like it was two hours. It was like 20 something minutes. It's only minutes. a 20 minute drive, but the traffic in California, traffic. obviously, where you go is, is going to extend time. So I said, man, let me make it easy and come to Pat. We met. And so it was, um, I think it was an accident, probably. I don't know. I, I assume everybody out here just drives perfectly. You We're know? pretty far east here of LA. We're about an hour east of LA. And I'm another 30 east of here, so that kind of puts it in perspective where we are on the location. We're directly east of downtown L.A. where we are right now, though. We can literally get on the freeway and go straight east, 30 minutes, or an hour, I mean, and we're downtown L.A. Wow. West. I think we have to go west. We got to go west. Yeah, we're east of L.A. Sorry. You get it. Yeah. I mean, and so hard on directions. Yeah, it's I'm weird that SmackDown goes I'm there. Why is SmackDown there, Pat? Stone Cold Hustler. Don't get it crazy. He's not yeah. just a hustler. He's a Stone Cold Hustler. Yeah. I, I have oh, yeah. no idea. Holy shit. They must have fucking, they must have owed somebody something fierce. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know who's here. There's a minor league what? What is it? The Hockey. rain, dude. Hockey it's the rain. Hockey. So it used to be Citizens Bank Arena years ago. And it used to be, uh, I want to say, yeah, the Kings have always been there. So I think the LA, the, the the Lakers and the Clippers play preseason games in there for the local community as kind of a PR deal. I think the uh, Mighty Ducks and the Kings used to play there in preseason. Gordon Bombay, dude. Hell yeah. yeah. So that's what it is for. It's not a real, you know, and they got a lot of concerts in there, a lot of, uh, you know, shit like that. Hey, we sold the place out. I assume there's going to be people from all across oh, yeah. Southern Let's California. Let's go. Because there's a lot of access, freeway access here. Probably going to be a lot of movie stars and shit, too. Well, fucking, I mean, JB ain't going to be there, but somebody yeah, maybe like JB would be there, hopefully, a couple people. Yeah, Who is like JB? What's that? Who is like JB that could be there? I don't know what it looks like a fucking, I don't know what A-list celebrities are anymore, but maybe. I ain't no fucking A-list. Oh, oh, come, come on. Come on. Netflix International Superstar. Maybe John Malkovich. You could go as John Malkovich. Paul Giamatti. Yeah, Michael Ooh. Rappaport. I'll call Michael Rappaport and have me and Michael go on. I, we should have Mike on the show. Us three? Oh, fuck. Mike, have you seen Michael Rappaport imitate me for Halloween? Oh, my God. <laughs> Google that shit. Have, to, have them pull that up, dog. You want to laugh? Rappaport's an interesting guy. <laughs> Rappaport, he is mad at everything at all times. I'm surprised you two get along. That makes no sense at all. Oh, yeah. We, yeah, that's not. Nah, I, I hey, why I, is he burying everybody? But JB's burying everybody we know now. What you do know, you mean? Have you noticed mm -hmm. that? That has become a thing. Who? It's not your Rappaport. You're talking about Mike Rappaport. Right? <laughs> 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 Joe. 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 Joe.